so basically our system, we've, we tried to keep things, but well, we worked very hard actually to, to make everything as thin and as small as possible. Um, because we believe that the highest possible efficiency across the widest possible range is the key to a foil that not only performs really well in one set of conditions, but will allow you to get out in light wind and big waves and just have this just this diverse setup. And, and efficiency is is key to that. So the fuselage, we've made it a stainless steel and gone basically as thin as we possibly could. Um, hmm. And then this piece here, which is really just stiffness critical, it's not strength critical. Um, we've made out of compression molded um, carbon. So can't really see that because the lighting, but that's just a, uh, that's basically this uh, hex cell product that we, that we use. And they put that under, it's 12,000 pounds per square inch um, to make this like oh, no way. super precise part. Yeah. So they do that for us as well as the mast. Now, how does that tie to, is that all one piece or is that tied together? Yeah. So basically the, the wing and this stainless steel section are permanently bonded. Um, so that way we okay. don't have any, anything interrupting flow or minimal flow interruption in this section here. And also like a super stiff, um, connection here. Cause that's, that's what we've found in testing. Basically the, the connection between your mast and your front wing, like everything that's going on from here to the mast foot. You can have the stiffest materials and the best construction, but if you have any play in that, you know, you, you lose everything. So we did a lot of uh, engineering work to make sure that that is just absolutely locked in and there's no play. And even as this connection wears, like the carbon wears, it's a taper. So it'll just sit ever so slightly deeper and still like the connection doesn't actually bottom out. Uh, it sits in that, that tapered okay. uh, section there. That's exactly what Adrian was saying from Axis as well, because I had him on recently, and he's saying the the biggest and most important thing was that mass connection. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Okay, so let's work down that. So then you have the front wing is mounted to that, and then the how does the other piece attach to your to your tail? So this is just two uh, two screws. They're hard to tell because they're black, but they're just M six okay. uh, hardware. So. Our foil oh, okay. uses everything is M6. Um, there's three M6 bolts that basically suck that the mast foot into the fuselage. Um, these two kind of basically it's like a scarf joint from carpentry, and then you know the we've just got the standard 30 millimeter spacing M6 for the tail. All right, cool. And then so that's a higher aspect one. Yeah, this is our 850. Um, so. Okay. It's probably going to be like wider aspect when people are watching it, eh? Um, yeah, no, yeah, fair enough. I guess it's a mid, right? I would, I would call this a high aspect. Um, both of our foils are ninety span, so our ten fifty, I would kind of call like a mid high aspect, and uh, our eight fifty, I think, is a is a true, you know, high aspect foil. 